this is Nats from Arnovia. In this video we're going to be detailing some of our TDPA technology. So this technology is using our corner and wall base traps along with our sub trap. I'm demonstrating a corner base trap here. This is a vector base trap. So we have various front designs that match all of our absorber panels. So this simply clips in place on the front of the base trap panel. You can see the membrane of the product here. So TDPA stands for Tunable Pistonic Diaphragmatic Absorber. What does this mean basically? It's a new membrane design that we employ in these products. So what, what this basically is, is a certain mass, which you can see in the center here with the weight and the MBF board, that's suspended on a stretched elastic membrane that you can see along the perimeter of the panel here. What this, this allows us basically to tune membranes with much higher weights than we could use in traditional base trap design which means we can reach much lower frequencies and much more precisely with the base trap. So this is a tunable product. We can tune this to work in between 60 to 80 hertz, it's peak efficiency. So it isn't a very, it's quite a wise working range. So this position, which is the position it's shipped in, works from around 58 to 64, 65 hertz at peak efficiency. If you wanted to change this peak efficiency, all we need to do is change the configuration of the weights on the front of the membrane. So, in the center of the membrane, there's a small diagram which shows you the precise, the precise configuration for each of the tuning positions. So, for example, if we wanted to change the tuning to, say, 70 hertz, what we need to do is to remove this weight and this weight. I can, I can demonstrate that now. So, it's very easy. All we need to do is to unscrew each weight. You can use a, a proper screw, a simple screwdriver to do this. Now. The essential part of this process is to replace the screw once you unscrew the weight. This is so, the, the inner volume, the pressure here is distinct from the exterior pressure, so we need to make sure this is always airtight. So the screws have a small rubber washer on the end just to make sure that's airtight. So I can remove this one as well. There we go. And again, replace the screw. There you have it. This panel would now be tuned to work 70 hertz. So again, replacing the front, it's a simple procedure, it just pushes in to the receivers here. So, so these panels and the TDPA design panels are all designed to work in high pressure zones. But that basically means that the membrane reacts to pressure. That's, it means that when, when the panel is in a room you know, such as this one, You'll, you'll be in the pressure zone for all of the width and length modes. It won't always be in the pressure zone for the height mode. So to address this issue, if I remove the panel, you can see the whole back of the panel is filled with high density foam agglomerate. Now this is what we call a, a velocity absorber base trap. So it means that each of these panels work always in two different ways. You have the tunable membrane for the pressure zones, and you have the velocity core for all of the other modes that you aren't treated with that. All in all, it makes it extremely efficient product. So for more information about the base trap and other um, TDPA products, check out our website for more details and installation guides. Mm -hmm.